To meet the goals of reducing climate gases, the world has taken to renewable energy by storm. World goals range from a reduction of fossil fuels anywhere from 20 to 40 percent within 20 years. An aggressive push is now in effect to fund as many renewable projects as possible, as quickly and as logically as possible. More than 180 banks and financial institutions have earmarked funds for renewable projects that will reach into the trillions of dollars. The current focus on biorenewables has been a long time coming, but it's now a mature industry and there's a rapidly growing demand for energy-related green bond offerings with waste to energy being part of this mix of sustainable energies. The current performance of the waste to energy industry is truly awe-inspiring. While there's an obvious need to prevent the excessive generation of waste, the technologies for energy from waste recovery can assume a central part in mitigating the problem and cleaning up the environment at the same time. Studies have shown that communities using energy from waste solutions generally account for higher recycling than those that do not. Today, waste to energy projects based on combustion technologies are highly efficient plants that utilize solid waste as their fuel as opposed to oil, coal, or natural gas. In this remedial technology, it is far better than burning up energy or to search, recover, process, and convey the fuel from some distant source. Waste to energy technology finds worth in what others consider trash. Faced with the costly problems of waste disposal and observing the heightened international need for more energy, a growing number of countries are turning to gasification, a time-tested and environmentally sound way of converting the energy in carbon-based feedstock into useful products such as electricity, fertilizers, transportation fuels, and chemicals. On average, conventional waste-to-energy plants that use mass burn incineration can convert one ton of municipal solid waste to approximately 550 kilowatt hours of electricity. In comparison, gasification technology a single ton of municipal solid waste can be used to produce up to 1,000 kilowatt hours of electricity, a much more efficient and cleaner way to utilize this source of energy. Our clients' refineries convert various debris produced by agriculture, households, businesses, and industrial sources into clean natural gas. This debris is produced in high quantities every day and creates a variety of costly problems for the community and the environment. Through a process called dual fluid bed gasification, which turns debris into synthetic gas and is the ideal ratio for hydrogen, carbon dioxide, hydrocarbons and carbon monoxide, and can be used to produce a variety of usable fuels which can be converted to power such as thermal, electricity, liquid fuel, synthetic gas and hydrogen. Dual fluid bed gasification has a variety of environmental and economic benefits over competing incineration. This gasification technology is the most efficient tool for carbon recycling. To begin, carbon-rich waste material is fed into the gasifiers where a renewable carbon-rich gas is produced. The resulting synthetic carbon gas is then converted into synthetic fuels and energy sources which are subsequently consumed by communities and industry. The carbon emissions produced are then reabsorbed by industry, agriculture and forestry to produce second-generation waste debris which is delivered back to the gasifiers and the carbon recycling process begins again. Simply put, our most utilized energies and fuels go through a no-burn, non-incinerator process and produces ecologically friendly hydrogen, steam and hydrocarbons. In 1990, Gussing was a poor city in Austria located near the communist border. With the implementation of Gussing Renewable Energy Dual Fluid Bed Gasification, Gussing became energy self-sufficient, 1,500 jobs were created, and it became the second richest community in the province. The fundamental business model of Gussing Renewable Energy is the provision of communities with energy, thereby aiming at the creation of energy self-sufficient and safety, as well as jobs through new business establishments. They assist communities in producing reliable energy of certifiable quality from local and regional available renewable resources. This way, capital remains in the region where it serves as a catalyst for positive economic trends, promotes major communal developments, and improves the quality of life in the community. 
Lusing Renewable Energy provides the planning, design, construction, operation, and sale of customized, highly efficient, and reliable CO2 neutral solutions for all communities, business enterprises, industries, and households which have a need for self-sufficient, sustainable energy production with CO2 neutrality. For attaining this green recycling outcome, Various technologies from Goosing Renewable Energy and international technology partners are used. Goosing Renewable Energy develops the organizational structure of franchise and license models on a client-specific, request-oriented basis and offers training for technical staff commonly referred to as Build, Own, Operate and Transfer, or BOOT. In closing, Goosing Renewable Energy has an admirable reputation for forward thinking and a successful track record in the sustainable green energy marketplace worldwide. Their technology has come at the right time and is ready to be taken to the next level through a successful bond issue. For further information, please contact Impact International Secured Investments at impactisi.com backslash contact.